You know, there, there's always the, the, that speculation that the, the orcs are bloodlust and hungry for war and just want to fight all the time. And I, I, I would like to clarify that that's not true most of the time. Some of us actually aspire to be different things, and I feel like I could be one of those ones that could, you know, break some new ground, you know what I mean? I mean, like, you look at me and think that I was built for battle, and believe me, that is what my father set out for me, and I, I just was not a fan of it at all. My brother certainly was, and when he came home for the first time with the skulls of his enemies at school, it just... I don't know, it creeped me out. It really did. I, I don't know if because I was young at the time, but it just was not me. So, I... I pursued different things. I I wanted to write, so I wrote my first book about you know growing up in my household, and uh, let's just say my father was not a fan of it, mainly because, well, it, I talked about other things besides war, and you'd think he would be mad about all the things I insulted him. In fact, he actually told me he liked that part. Um, Unfortunately, the, f the first book didn't do so well. It got canned because it only, it only spread circulation among the tribes, and let's just say maybe I, uh, I did get a little angry. I found the first negative critiques home, and I, uh, well, I, 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 I broke his house a little bit. J just a little. Not, not enough that he couldn't possibly go back to it, but enough to <laughs> send a message to him, you know what I mean? <laughs> uh, you know, when I did that, that was the first time my dad ever told me he was proud of me. And the irony of it all. One time I finally get mad, and my dad is happy. And honestly, I didn't know how to feel about that at the time. But hey. Orcs be orcs, you know what I mean. <laughs>